Hey gang. Well, Super Bowl Sunday has come and gone. And um, what can I say? My prediction was wrong again for like the fourth, fifth, sixth, eighth, tenth year in a row. I don't know. Um, 49ers lost. But at least this time, they were just a little bit closer to being the, being the Chiefs. And, uh, you know, and so the Chiefs are the uh, Super Bowl champions and yada, 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 and all this other stuff. Um, not much I can tell you about from the game that I want to talk about. You know, the, the halftime show was like, man, eh, somebody else came out who was past their prime, decided to perform. That's all Super Bowl seems to get. A lot of these performers who just, just way outdated and uh, irrelevant and everything like that. And um, so you go out there, do do the little lip syncing stuff, and then that's about it. Oh man. But I read something about that hap about something that happened that I really want to talk to you guys about, and um, <laughs> and it's really just one of these things where I just sit there and I think to myself, man, you know, celebrities can be scum sometimes. Uh, it's about Alyssa Milano and a little stunt she pulled. Um, some of you may remember her from Charmed. Some of you may remember her from Who's the Boss, or the movie Commando, or. Double Dragon, or a lot of her B-movies where she's showing that she's all grown up. Um, apparently, the thing is, she started a GoFundMe for her son. I believe it was for her baseball team. If any of this is incorrect, please let me know in the comments below. So, I mean, it, you, you should be able to find it on Google, no problem. But she started to go find me for her ba for her son's baseball team, only to use the money to go to the Super Bowl. And there are a lot of people that are outraged about this, and I don't really blame them. Uh, I think the whole thing was stupid. You know, you you don't do that to people. You don't beg for money to take it to yeah, to do stupid things like that. But it's really amazing to me how you know people are just. You know, we're always being told, you know, we should idolize and worship celebrities and everything like that. But when they do something stupid like this, it's, it's ridiculous. And I can't really rant on it that much because, I mean, let's face it, she's not the first celebrity who did something stupid, who took people's money and did something completely dumb with it. Um, you know, and I mean, I can kind of understand how people are, are on the hate wagon, I guess you could call it, for uh, Alyssa Milano. Uh, the, the first thing I heard about her that people just didn't like about her, well, well, one of the first things I heard about her that nobody really liked about her that much was that she was not a fan of, of Donald Trump. And I just rolled my eyes at that. I just said, who cares? You know, we, we don't always have to like the same things. You know, I don't like Donald Trump. I don't like any politician, to be honest with you. You know, and um, so it's like, it's her choice to like who she wants to like. So what? You know, I mean, she wasn't like Kathy Griffin and did what she did. Um, but, I mean, to, to pull a stunt like this, it was really, really uncool. And um, and I would like to think that, you know, she's going to face justice one of these days, but I doubt it. I mean, I don't want anything horrible to happen to her, but if karma ever hits her like a freight train, I just say, oh, well, you know. But... But for her to get people to, to give to her money, to give money to her son's baseball team, only to take her, only take him to the Super Bowl. See, I didn't believe it at first until I saw a selfie of it, and I went, oh, wow, that's, that's a kick in the lower extremities of that, if, if there hasn't been one before. Well, there has been, but that's, that's a severe one. You know, I just, I just think that's really, really wrong that, you know, people would give money to anybody celebrity or not and they take the money and run and there's been people there's been people who have done that who are non-celebrities who um who have taken people's money and, and did something stupid with it but you know again Alyssa milano is proving once again how much of a real piece of garbage she really is by doing something stupid like that i mean like i said i i didn't care if she liked trump or not i didn't care about what she did you know a lot of things she did in public but when she does something like that, that's 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 wrong. That's really low. And that's disgusting, and uh, you know everything like that. So, <sighs> but.
But again, it's to me, it's just another celebrity who nobody's heard from for a long, long time. It's, they probably just want to do it for the attention. So there you guys go. Um, as far as next year's Super Bowl, I'll, I'll tell you, um, I don't really follow who's on which side. I'm always hoping the Bears are going to get there, there again next year. Um, just they have to start beating the Browns, okay? I mean, come on. How do you lose to the Browns? And they've done it the past couple of years. And I was like, good Lord. But yet they, they still made it farther than the Browns, and they took on the Packers, and I guess the Packers beat them. What what a surprise there. So, uh, but as far as the Bears go, if they ever make it to the Super Bowl again, good. But they've been there, what, three times, I think. They've won it once. I'm happy about that. Um, honestly, I can see the 49ers and the Chiefs going at it again the next year or so, you know, probably before the end of this decade. And uh, if they do, I'll, I'll pick the 49ers again. So, you know, so to the Chiefs, you won the big one. Good for you guys. whoop de doo And uh, to your fans, I'm, I'm sure they're all happy. And, uh, yeah. So, and to Alyssa Milano, you're probably the reason why the 49ers lost. Because I imagine she was on their side anyway. So, there you go. <laughs> all right. So, gang, I'm going to get out of here. Get a couple more videos done because I got a lot of catching up to do. Got a lot of stuff to get done around here. So uh, the weather's looking really nice. It's supposed to be for the next few days, so I should, be, should, I should be able to get a few more videos done to catch up this week. So uh, whatever you think about this whole mess with Alyssa Milano, and uh, how do you feel about how the Super Bowl went? Was there anything that just, you know, you didn't like or anything like that? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you all. Hope you're having an awesome day. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you like my videos, please feel free to subscribe. Get over here. <laughs> I'm talking to an inanimate object. You stop disrespecting me. I know somebody who used to do that all the time. Trust me, it's frightening. No matter how many times I try to tell him, like, dude, it's an inanimate object. He just says, like, you, you disrespect me. He's like, oh, my God. <laughs> if you would, please go check out and subscribe to the following channels. Rena Wheat, Rena, Rena Vega, Grease Monkey 2.0, which hopefully you'll be out of your situation very, very soon, my friend. Uh, Rebel Rocker, Little B Fitness, Sherelle C, Rena Price, Betty Price, Tyler2071, Amber Sist and Danny, Danny Nightmare. And, um, man, oh, man, oh, man. What can I tell you, gang? I didn't watch a lot of the trailers to the Super Bowl, but there's one particular, or the commercials for the Super Bowl, but there's a trailer I did check out recently, and that's going to be up next on this channel tomorrow or something. I don't know. We'll, we'll see when I can get it done. Take care of yourselves. Try to be good. Try to be good to yourself. Try to be good to others. Until we do this again, as always, stay strong and rock on. I'm not going to throw that button because that would be, you know, stupid and everything like that. So, 